Let's march on, damn it. <laughs> Why not? Our final training day. We also have our uh, first scouting reports back. Before we start off the League 2 season against Newcastle, I believe it was. All right, it's the American Challenge Cup. We uh, we did terribly. Let's look at our first monthly scouting report from Mexico. Josep Salcedo. Not good enough. Alejandro Guzman. Andrea Saez. Again, we are pretty much only going to sign one player a year. Marco Diaz, Sergio Orozco, Lino Escobar. Like, we don't want to abuse the youth academy. Berkovic with Gavin Baker. Harry Thomas. Harry Bennett. He'll be signed, at least. Adam Mills and Kai Morris. So our first Welshman, Harry Bennett. That brings us to our final option here in France. Patrice Besnard. Besnard? Besnard. Sign him for the moment. Alexandre Vidal. Yanis Sanchez. 75 to 94. Jerome Maurice and Arthur Robert. <laughs> Robert. Okay. So we actually got a couple of players that are worth keeping an eye on. That brings us to four in the academy, but still the generated, like, provided player... Patrick Heath that we started with. I mean, he's a 65. Like, I can't imagine not signing this guy. He's four-star, five-star. Plus, I mean, again, they still generate, like, huge wingers. The guy's 6'5". Fucking hell. I think the only way in which I'm going to use the uh, developmental programs is if I want to change positions. Uh, I'm not going to worry about the uh, the skills, you know, the, the work rates, the weak foot, whatever. Let's see. Indeed, it will be Newcastle coming up. Straight A's across the board. So our first game in League 2 is against Newcastle. Let's see. To start off, let's go with the pre-match press conference. It is worth noting as well. The um, the new system in terms of uh, personality types and stuff like that, but I don't honestly even know where to go to look at that uh, new bit of business. So the pre-match press conference, Jurgen Klopp, he's a handsome devil, leader of men. Oh, captain, my captain. Everyone's making their predictions. Looks like a really exciting title race this year. How are you feeling? Do you think your team can be up there and challenge? I fucking hope so. It's League Two. Uh, we always believe we can win. That's a very Jurgen answer. I believe in these players. They believe in themselves. Very, very Jurgen. Very Jurgen. It's a big fixture to kick off the season. Newcastle will be strong opposition. <laughs> oh, shit. We don't have to talk about how the season actually went. Um... I believe in my players. I believe in them. Many people expected Liverpool to be more active in the transfer window. I I feel attacked with how realistic this is so far. I'll sign players who are right for us. That's, uh... I think we're in good shape. Uh, yeah, I'll sign players who are right for us is a very... Very Jurgen answer as well. Thank you, I will not take any more questions. So what's like the response from the locker room after that? Do we even know? I guess we don't. Newcastle. St. Maximin, Alex Isak, Almiron, Jolington. It's not bad. It's not bad. Let's uh let's simulate the match and see what happens from here. I'm rooting for you, boys. I'm rooting for you. So do they have, I don't think they have the ability to sim it any faster, right? Like, this is just how it goes. Still, I wanted to see if they had changed this at all. So we probably won't sim like this too often. I also don't hate the idea of playing the highlights, but I still don't believe they have the option in FIFA to just outright watch the AI play. Let me score there. Uh, to watch the AI play like we do in uh, pretty much every other game. 
Come on, boys, get this first goal. At least they're not at least they're not lackadaisical. You know? There's a mod for that, of course there is. Good movement, good movement. Break them down. Another missed shot. Tis another missed shot. And we've dominated possession so far. Which means they're going to score first. They're 100% going to score first. You already know what's coming. You already know. It has been a relatively quiet first half until that. Luis Diaz kicks off our League 2 season. First goal of the campaign. Oh, thank God Allison stopped that. Good, we're up 1 0 at halftime, unless we blow it here. Please don't blow it here. Thank you. Good. Good, good, good. 7.2 rating for Diaz, highest in the match so far. Let us resume. Let us resume. I might jump in just to double check that whole uh, AI thing, because this might be the way we do it. It's sim a little bit. And then make the switch. I am hoping we get this first win. Obviously, we won't do this for every game this season. It would take forever to actually get through it. Same with playing it. Where's the where's the fun necessarily in playing every League 2 game? I mean, there is there can be some fun in it. but Mo? No. No, it's fine. Yes, yes, sir. Yes, sir. Luis Diaz. Two goals in the season opener. Newcastle. Getting dunked on. True Jordy and shambles. This is a beautiful start. To the new campaign. Good save by Allison. First real chance of the game for them. We're looking okay. Up and over to Mo. Good save. Good save, good save. But we're looking good. I'm going to sim this until about the 80th minute. And then we're going to double check what's up. Alright. Let's see what we got. Again, the jump in is so absurdly fast. Over to settings. Select sides up. Oh, will it let us do it? It used to not let you do that. Yeah. Yeah, it still doesn't. In order to continue, you must have a controller assigned to the team you have chosen to play this game with. Yeah. So unfortunately, uh, that's a shame. That is a shame. There is still no like spot on way to. Uh, Spectate AI versus AI in career mode, which is uh, which is a bit of a shame. Let's play a little bit with this team, though. Hopefully not ruin the clean sheet. That would suck. Mr. Matip. But yeah, that's that's a shame, because obviously in, like, uh, exhibition, it's fine. Jesus Christ, Trent, that was terrible. Yeah, in exhibition, it's fine, but it's... Um, it won't let you do it in career mode, which is a shame, because it can be fun to watch the AI, definitely. Callum, quit acting like anything's going to happen. Yeah, it's like the only game, like the only EA game that does that. NHL, Madden. Like, it lets you, lets you view AI versus AI. Darwin, you gotta shield that better, buddy. Darwin? Darwin? Wonder why they don't let you. I don't know. I it's just I guess with the control they prefer you to have career mode wise, but it does feel like a bit of an oversight. Here's to you, Jordan Henderson. Oh captain, my captain. You'll love to see it. So we're gonna win. What a lovely turn of events compared to what real uh, compared to what really happened. We're gonna win. 
in week one against Newcastle. Jordan Henderson on the board. The elite Jordan Henderson. Don't let anyone tell you otherwise. He might not be anymore, but uh, a leader of men. Jordan Henderson. Bringing off Tiago is typically not a good idea, but that's okay. A very, very good performance, but yeah, it is uh, It is a shame they set it up the way they did with not being able to watch, but Cosmic, what's going on, man? It, uh, yeah, I don't know. Obviously, it, you know, it makes the uh, other sports franchise modes that we play more interesting, getting to watch the AI play, but there we go. It's a week one victory in the books in League Two. They're going to and the boys on their way back to the Prem. At least this is the the start of it. It's the start of it. Boy, that place emptied out or just wasn't full at all. There's no way Hendo got man of the match, right? Like, Luis Diaz had two goals. There's no way. It's a beautiful thing. That is how you kick off a campaign to make it back to a higher division. God damn. I'll take it though. Here's the highlight. <laughs> the one highlight from when we were playing. I don't know if they tried an offside trap or what the hell they tried, but we'll take the outcome. Victory in week one. In fairness, it probably did that because the, the Diaz highlights wouldn't have been there because we simmed that part of it. So it makes some sense. Oh, the post match. What is your question for me? How about the as a stunning performance and his two goals? What are your thoughts about your star man? Couldn't have asked more. It's not just about one player. He capped a good team display. I couldn't have asked more. Let's hype him up a little bit. Why not? He did very well. I oh, said Newcastle, we're never going to be able to put your team under pressure. And three goal margin proved that. Why weren't your opponents able to compete today? Oh, God. Oh, I'd rather focus on where we need to improve. I knew that would make people less happy, but it's true. Why are you so pissy? Your team is able to turn things around pretty spectacularly. Great win. What did you do differently today? We pride ourselves on our resilience. Good character. We learned that from Brendan Rogers. <laughs> Jurgen just picked up the torch. All right, so yeah, there we go. Let's uh, take a look. For those about to score, I Take a look, Icon. Thank you for the 16 months, buddy. How you doing tonight? Thank you for watching me yell at video games. It's an honor. Uh, I wanted to look at the news. Not the news. It's been so long since I've messed around in FIFA career mode. I don't remember where to look in terms of the results for the week. I know I can see the standings. I don't remember where to look to be able to see the other results that happened. It's a bit of a shame. We'll just move on. Because we have a cup match, the Carabao Cup against Bonsley. That will be the opportunity for our second team to shine. Their sharpness is in the toilet. So I'm a little bit afraid about how uh, how poor this might be. But then we got Bournemouth coming up on the weekend. It's in standings on the right. So if I go back to League Two. Aha! Thank you, God. Thank you, thank you. Uh, is there already previous results? Scroll back to the top. There we go. Oh, Fulham drew Leicester. Palace over Middlesbrough. West Ham kicked the shit out of Wigan. City over Chelsea. Southampton over Bournemouth. Brentford over Stoke. Everton beat... Everton. Everton beat Manchester United. Arsenal drew Villa. Wolves uh, stomped out Brighton. 
And Forest over Birmingham, Tottenham over Leeds. Use this while you're in League Two. So I have inverted the standings. Premier League to League Two, Championship to League One. In France, League One swaps with League Two. Same for Germany with Leagues One and Three. We put all the top teams at the bottom. So it's a bit of a rebuilding challenge. Shakes things up. Let's sim this game against Bonsley. This, uh, this should be a win. It really should be. Like, this should be a quick sim, easy does it victory. Thank you. I was worried. Two goals for the Ohlone Arthur Melo. We'll take that. And we advance in the Carabao Cup. Thank God. Because that's the only way people are actually going to get playing time throughout the season. And back to the Premier League. First team is in against Bournemouth. This should also be a pretty straightforward win. Should be. Should be. I am I'm scared to hit play highlights. I, you know what? I want to see what this play highlights option will do for us. Why not? Let's let's explore it early on enough in the season against old Bournemouth. Let's uh, let's explore it enough. It's our home opener anyway at Anfield. Let's explore this bad boy. I'm intrigued. Plus, I mean, for those who aren't like familiar with FIFA but are hanging around anyway, I mean, the presentation's still fucking top notch between this and NBA. Oh, Bournemouth. Tons of fans for a League 2 match. <laughs> this place would still be pretty damn full, even if they fell to League 2. I mean, Liverpool didn't, uh, and they haven't been outside the top flight since the fucking 60s. Yeah. I don't love these, these, these League 2 presentation packages. See, like, you would expect us to be able to work our way back pretty soon. I am intrigued at how long it takes a club like Bournemouth. Like, do they get just stuck for years? in advance of two holding midfielders but it's important that the wide players come in field to join the center forward at the right should be a very straightforward win for us you think everything gets relegated i hope so i hope so something about those board with kids though i do like them i do like them Oh, I know, Frank. Yeah. <laughs> yeah, a team like Forrest. Like, we finally made it to the prep. Bam! Right down to the bottom. The fans are always part of the story here so I hit play highlights. Okay, Liverpool attack in the ninth minute. Okay, sure. This is interesting. Mohamed Salah! No. <laughs> Okay, so I mean, this is what I thought it would be. It's just very interesting. Oh, to Darwin! Darwin Nunez! <laughs> Alright, they totally fucked low shots, man. Oh my god, I do not understand. Like, I'm just trying to aim. Trying to hit a low shot. To possible Darwin Nunez! There it is. I mean, Cosmic, it exists. But, uh... Holy fuck, good luck trying... Ooh, we got a penalty. Okay. Alright, Mo. I have yet to see the new penalty system. Oh, God. And a chance for 2 the going in the right What a save! Dude, this is insane to play the highlights. What the fuck? All right, I have seen the new corner, or not the new corner, but the new free kick. It's, uh, it's interesting.
Okay, let's, uh... It was on target. What was he doing in the back? That's a new thing people do is they lay down and stop the low shot. But yeah, the whole uh, low driven shot experience does not exist anymore, as I've discovered. This is an interesting way to play career mode, man. Just in highlight form. Well, he made that interception look routine. In truth, it wasn't. And the ball in the net at Crossing opportunity. Coming through. Alex Scott. It's another goal for West Ham United. It was a poor, poor clearance. And it was far too easy for him after that. They've pulled ahead by two with just over ten minutes left to play. Yeah. Thanks for the update, Alex. Another penalty. <laughs> All right, Mo, let's try this again, buddy. I'm afraid to, to like, really aim intensely. To finish it as a contest. He hey, there it is. Well, we didn't quite beat him 9-0, but, uh... I converted two of the chances we were given. That is the ball. Guys, settle down. It's fucking Bournemouth. Settle down. Settle down. It's fucking bored, man. Jesus Christ. You would have thought we just won the goddamn league again. It's fucking bored, man. Jesus. That's pretty cool, though. I like that. Because you can set it up for both offensive and defensive uh, situations. Obviously, that's a super quick way to try to play through a game. But I don't hate that. I don't hate that. He was really sharp today. Except for the, uh, the low driven attempt that no longer exists, apparently. Even then, like, I was just trying to aim it like you would a normal shot to the corner. And I guess if you power shot, it manual aims it, huh? Hence the, in that direction, instead of straight forward. But we'll take that. We will take that. Good game for Darwin. Good game for Mo. 2-0 over Bournemouth. We're laughing. We're laughing right now. Power shots manually need time to actually shoot. It can't really use it in the box. Duly noted. So they, they outright got rid of low driven then, huh? Outright. So we are 2-0 oh in the Premier League. I didn't get a post interview. Game against Luton rescheduled. Mr. Matip. Outstanding son. <laughs> and for Mr. Diaz. Great performance. Abby, I'm so sorry. I, I forgot to talk to you. Um, we'll be okay, though. Let's take a look at the results from last week. Brighton and Villa drew Arsenal over Everton, United over Stoke, Leeds and Brentford drew Tottenham over Southampton, City over Newcastle, Chelsea over Forest, Wigan and Birmingham drew West Ham over Crystal Palace, Leicester, Middlesbrough. Wolves over Fulham. Okay. All right. Uh, Cody, no, it's clear on my side. That'd be that'd be all you. Another league match. It is against Spurs. Old Tottenham. Let's just go ahead and sim this at this stage. LFC, what's up? Um, I am really tempted by the play highlights option. At the same time, I do like it. Like, I don't know. I, I like the idea of play highlights, but I also like the idea of just simming and letting this do its own thing and seeing where we end up. I don't know. That's why uh, it's just where I'm torn right now. But I kind of like not influencing like how much we advance early on. Like we were going to beat Bournemouth regardless, so it didn't matter. But against... Uh, I don't know, against Tottenham. Yeah, what's going on? Against Tottenham, let's let's just quick sim it. It's early enough in the season. Let's let's let it let's let it do its thing. That's a big win early on. Luis Diaz and Fabinho. Oh shit, I could hit Y for post match. Whoops. Well that is a big 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 win for us. And we are one of three teams that are perfect. Four teams, excuse me. Wolves, also perfect so far this season. 
Middlesbrough over Fulham, West Ham over Leicester, Palace over Birmingham, Chelsea over Wigan, Newcastle drew Forest, City absolutely smashed Bournemouth, Brentford and Southampton drawing, United and Leeds, Arsenal over Stoke, Brighton over Everton, and Wolves over the Villa. Poor Aston Villa. So right now, I mean, only three games in. Bournemouth, uh, one goal, four, eight against. And yeah, it's true. We haven't been scored on seven matches. Or seven matches, I wish. Three matches with seven goals. It's not that bad. Uh, what is our chat here? Nabi Keita. I bet you would like to talk about... Uh, uh, let, 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 maybe at some point in the future we'll talk about that contract, buddy. <laughs> I'm not... Uh, I'm not guaranteeing much there. Not guaranteeing much. Now, we do have another league match. The boys are a little bit tired, but I think for the most part, good enough to go. It's Brentford. This should be another pretty straightforward Simmet no problem victory. It really should be. It's Brentford. GG's. Thank you. Let's go. Still four clean sheets to start the season. Two more goals for Diaz. Who needs Sadio Mane? Sadio Mane. Who needs him? Let's go. We're crushing it so far. Absolutely crushing it. It's like we're actually in League Two. <laughs> Instead of, you know, actually playing the Premier League teams. Oh, Jurgen, you handsome devil. Headlines all about Luis Diaz. Of course it is. I could not have asked for more from him. How could I? So far ahead of the table in such good form to get the impression that Brentford were a little bit intimidated. We were ruthless out there. Let, let's let's say that. Let's not shit on let's not shit on, you know, Brentford, but we were ruthless out there. Up against Brentford, your team was able to turn things around. Great win. What you'll do differently? It's always we we pride ourselves on our resilience. How many times will I answer that? How many times will I answer that specific question? Find out next time on Dragon Ball Z.